Good morning, everybody. So today I am in the city of Laverne. I am here in front of Mi Ranchito's Mexican restaurant to take on their burrito challenge. I am super excited. I'm going to meet up with Dan versus World. He's coming in a bit, but we're both going to be taking this on and I am craving some burritos. So let's go inside this place and check it out. Yay! <music> The Wall of Fame here, the big burrito challenge at Mi Ranchitos. Awesome. And you get a cool t-shirt if you win. So I'm in the kitchen uh, looking at them making the burrito and Dan is here. Yay! Ooh, what's up guys? Awesome. So have you ever done food challenges before? I've done a couple. Okay. But um, not as much as Reina, of course. So yeah, want to come in positive, but probably going to take a fat L no, 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 I believe you can do it. So All this right, is five pounds. They have a scale here. They're actually very truthful with this, and they, they just weigh the trays that they're going to be putting on there. So the trays weigh about one pound each, so it'll be six pounds in total, but it'll be five pounds of food. So I think you got this. All right. Awesome. Let's do it. So, oh, wait, it's four. They are making the burrito here. This is four tortillas. And this is the chili Colorado. So both of these are pork, right? <coughs> Pork? Pork, 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 pork. Oh, pork beef. Okay, awesome. Can I actually change mine to this one? If you haven't made it yet? Oh, no, yeah, yours is that one. Oh, okay, yeah, cool. yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, and then we got some fresh vegetables going up on top. And then fresh pico de gallo. Wait, real quick to see how much it's at. Seven, okay? Okay. And then we're gonna wrap it up. Oh, it's like spilling out. Look at that. Wow. Okay, there it is. Yeah. And we're gonna put the sauce. Awesome. Rhino cheese on top. Beautiful. Alright, and then into the oven it goes. Ooh, here it comes. Awesome. It has to be eight in 45 minutes. Thank you. This one is yours. Awesome. Oh, this one is his. Okay. Beautiful. Okay, guys, so this looks incredible. This is six pound burrito right here. I'm here with Dan. We're going to be taking this on together. And um, he got shredded beef. Shredded chicken and uh, beef dorado. Okay, I got that. I got the beef, dor beef dorado and then chili verde. So they're more sauced up. I got a timer here, and you asked me if there was any strategies, right? Yeah, do you have a strategy? Because whoo, Well, usually, like, with burritos, burrito, guys. I like to start with the filling first. I like to, like, cut it open, but mm. I got some gloves. Do you need gloves? Um, yeah, I should probably get some gloves. All right, Can he get a pair of gloves, too? Yeah. Let me put my hair up real quick. It looks delicious, though. Mm -hmm. I love eating burritos. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I like to start with the filling first and then eat the tortilla after mm -hmm. because the tortilla kind of like makes it very uh, filling for you. Um, and then if you just start with the insides for it, it's not as crazy because there's four massive tortillas in here, mm -hmm. by the way. So it's not a small burrito. Not gonna lie, it's making me a little nervous. <laughs> but at least they weighted, so we know like it's a fair amount. Mm -hmm. And I got my timer here. Five pounds, right? Um, six. Six, six pounds. Hello, thanks Thank for tuning you. in. Appreciate it. Can we ask you guys to do a countdown for us? Is that okay? Do like a five, four, three, two, one, yeah. real quick? Yeah? Yeah, that'd be fun. <sighs> whenever we're ready. I'm ready whenever. He just didn't put on gloves. That'd be, that'd be, that's exciting. <laughs> What's this? Oh, okay. Time to get to work. There's, you got, oh, shit, almost fell. You have 45 minutes. There's 45 minute time limit for this. Okay, are you ready? Okay, can I have you guys count it, count it down? Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Right, let's go. Oh, there you go. There you go. Oh, all right, here we go. Oh, uh, I just cut it open. Hand. Yes.
He's killing it. <laughs> yeah. Is it hot? No pie. getting wrecked. What time is it? Four minutes? Mm -hmm. You can finish it at five. It's barely A little over. <laughs> Awesome, awesome. Oh, thank man. you, thank you. Amazing. That's crazy. Oh, five crazy. minutes 25. Yeah, yeah. Five minutes 25. Wow. Thank you. We're still going over here, though. Oh, no, no, you're doing good. You're doing good. Yeah. No, ignore me. I've, I've been doing this for way too long. I just took long. the fattest L. No, 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 it's not an L. It's fatter than this burrito. <laughs> mm. 
That was impressive. Thank you, thank you. One question for the... Um, I'm sure some of the viewers are wondering too, where do you put all that? <laughs> That's true. I, I don't know. I just, I've always eaten a lot all my life. Mmm. Uh, What's his bag doing here? Oh, that's a secret. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, guys. <coughs> Alright, let me turn that Ooh. on off real quick. Well, congratulations. Thank you, Very thank impressive. you. Thank you so much. Nice to meet you. Thank you, I appreciate it. I'm okay. definitely going to use the whole 45 minutes. Yeah, no, you're doing good. You're doing good. Mm. But the inside is so easy to eat because it's like so sauced up. How come this doesn't light up? I thought it was supposed to light up. Oh, there we go. Sorry, it's a new timer. I'm still trying to learn how to use it. You would have told me it was dark. Whew. Okay. Oh man. I wish my eyes were good, guys. I'm sorry. I can't read any of the comments. I guess I can bring it closer. Hold on. Let's bring it in closer. There we go. We're gonna see Dan up close. What is saying? Reina is crazy. Reina is crazy is literally crazy. <laughs> is it Instagram? Uh, TikTok. TikTok? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, they've been like they've been watching me play League, and then every time I'm playing League, they're like, Reina, where's the food? Can you do a food challenge? So I'm like, here it is. This is the here food stream. Is. This is the food stream right here. Oh, he's um he's he's getting it. What percentage would you say that I'm at right now? Mm, I think you're like a good 60% done. Mm. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, you're good. It was pretty good. Um, it, um, it's very flavorful. Yeah, it's just like, like, like I said, the inside's really easy to eat really fast because it's like really saucy. Mm -hmm. And then, um, yeah, it's just hard to eat tortilla fast. I need to get better at that. Tortilla eating training. I was better at swallowing tortilla. I probably got in another five minutes, but I just have to get more messy with this. By the way, for the viewers, you just beat the all-time record at this restaurant. <laughs> Previously held by yourself, right? Yeah. Dang. By a minute and mm -hmm. 20 seconds? That's crazy. Really? She's held by you? Not Randy? No. She said she beat Randy, and then she beat herself today. <laughs> <laughs> So what's your strategy with the liquids, like the water? Does that help? Or? Um, so the hot water sort of like melts the food for me, mm. you know, because it's like it's warm. So like I have different uses for different stuff, like hot water melts the food so I can eat it faster, and then Diet Coke helps expand my stomach because I get that burp to create more space. Yeah. Oh, where? Dude, we have 2,000 live, by the way. Oh, man. Yeah, 2.5K. This is way more than on my play League of Legends. Mm, true. Uh, people just like watching me eat food. Thanks for tuning in, you guys. This is Dan versus World. What's up, guys? He also does YouTube videos. He he does a lot of buffet stuff. I see you do a lot of buffet stuff, so that's yeah. fun. Mostly do like food reviews. Mm -hmm. Do a lot of buffets. But I just saw someone ask how many calories is in this. I have no idea. All I can say is that I'll probably be on the. Um, Stair stepper for like the next four hours. <laughs> How do I make this like? Can I zoom out or is it just like perma like this? I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm a new vertical. Is in the vertical? No, but it, usually when you live, it's this way anyway. Oh, hey, Lydia. Oh, shoot. Lydia's in the house. Who's Lydia? Um, she's a content creator in uh -huh. Vegas. Oh, hello. Mm -hmm. Thanks for coming in. Oh, I didn't know she was watching. I cool. Even, you know I should have done. I should have done that. No man. Like We're at Ni info. Ranchitos in Laverne, so he's still working on his. Yeah. Didn't know you were going to go live, that's why. But we're live. It's okay. Figuratively and literally. <laughs> Woo! I'm going to need some moral support right now from the live chat. You got, you got, so Ooh. he's pretty much got all the filling done, pretty much. Yeah. How are you feeling? Like, what percentage of full are you? I'm probably like 73%. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm eating a burrito, same as hers. 
from the set. You, if you, so if you eat it within 45 minutes, you get the meal for free, a picture of a Hall of Fame, and they have a very cool t-shirt that says, I ate the big one at Mi Ranchitos. It's pretty cool. Oh, man. Yeah. How many live viewers do you usually get for League? Um, when they come in, it's like 600 come in, but then people see that I'm not eating food, so they all leave. So it's like average 200 people watching me, but it's still something, you know? That's yeah. a lot. Yeah. I mean, three is a lot. <laughs> Meet me Ranchitos in Laverne, California. How much time I got? How much time do you have? Plenty. It hasn't even been, it's only 11 minutes. It's only been 11 minutes. Oh, man. Hey, Jen. <clears throat> the burrito weighs six pounds. So this is a six pound burrito. They put it on a scale and everything. I have footage of that. So when I edit everything, you guys will see that. Lydia says, I ate the big one t-shirt. Do they have that here, Lydia? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they do. Oh, nice. Yeah. So you've seen this video before, right, Lydia? Her previous one? Hello. Yes, mine is done. This is my plate. He's still, he's, he's, he's doing well. Oh, man. I do spicy challenges sometimes, but I'm not the best at it. Are you good at spicy? Um, no, I'm not, but oh. it's fun. <laughs> yeah. I'm so, I'll say I'm mid. Okay. Oh, oh, she, she actually has t-shirts for us ready. You want to show right now? Yeah, can I show? Oh. I'm just live, so I want to show them. So you guys, you- They're asking awesome. about Awesome, yeah, awesome. This there is so is, cool. Leah. This is the t-shirt right here that you win. I ate the big one at Mi Ranchitos in Laverne, California. So yeah, definitely check this place out. That food is so good. The meat just melts in your mouth. It was delicious. And this place is actually really close to me. Mm -hmm. The big one. It's cute. <laughs> 10,000 calories. Oh. It was a lot of cheese, so I was a little bit worried when I like dug my hand into it because I'm lactose intolerant and then I didn't take a lactate pill. Oh, <laughs> no, I had lactate pills in my bag. I didn't think about it. I was like, oh, oh maybe I messed up, but you know, it's okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? What is the easiest food challenge I have done? Um, easiest food challenges type for me is anything like that's Asian food just because I like grew up eating it and then it's very simple But I mean I'm from SoCal so like I grew up eating Mexican food as well So I love doing burritos and tacos. Those are like pretty fairly easy to me, too um, I'm actually doing a pupusa eating contest this Sunday. I didn't grow up eating pupusas, but I love pupusas So I'm excited for that. That's gonna be in Santa Ana So whoever can eat like a stack of like 13 pupusas or something first gets a hundred dollars I saw someone ask it in the live. But I also have the same question. Are you full? No. Like, you're not full. No. Damn. So you could do another eating challenge, like nothing. Uh, I wouldn't say another eating challenge, but I mean, I could eat for eat something. But I don't always do that. Like, I, I of just... Of course. Yeah, like, I, I'm human. I still gain weight. So I just oh. eat what I need to to not be hungry. But I, my, I know my capacity is more because I've trained to have more capacity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. How many hot dogs? See, I've never done a hot dog thing. I want to do a hot dog thing. That'd be cool. Woo. I don't know if she's human. <laughs> I'm human, I promise. <laughs> all right. Ooh, so OK, we're getting. Reign of strategy. Yeah, you did all the filling. Not all, but did most of the filling. Now it's time to go for the tortillas. Okay. The tortilla is hard because it's the carbs, so it'll fill you up. Yeah, so I was saying when you asked me for like advice, like there was one time where like I tried to do a burrito challenge without doing the filling first, and it really makes a huge difference. Like you feel the weight of the tortilla and the fullness a lot faster. Where do I find food challenges? You just Google it. Were, were you on the best Ruby Shri show? No, no, I haven't, but I want to be with him. 
He did ask me one time, but it, it didn't manage to collab. So well, that's unfortunate. Wait, what is this? Huh? These, these two icons, because that's Lydia to the right. Oh icon? really? Yeah. I don't. I don't know. I'll show you. I don't know. Like I, I, I'm still very new to streaming, so there's a lot of like icons and stuff, and like I don't understand what all these flowers and gifts mean. But thank you for sending those. Lydia, if you're still here, I need your uh, moral support. <laughs> All right, since I do a lot of content in SoCal and Vegas, mm -hmm. what food, um, one, what area has a better food, and two, what food challenges are harder, Vegas or like LA, SoCal? Um, it's so hard to compare because like SoCal is so diverse and much bigger. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think the food in SoCal is better. Um, I, you know, it's surprisingly, surprisingly, there's not much food challenges in both areas. Like that's that humongous. They're both about the same. Yeah. You go a lot in um, like middle America, right? Like the West. I, mean, uh, the I go, I go everywhere. Mm. Yeah. But they, I mean, everywhere has its own like huge, massive challenges and everywhere there's always average challenges as well. Oof. Okay. If you, if you, if you feel too heavy, you don't need to like, no, I'm no, gonna, you're good. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna push myself. Okay. It's me versus me right now. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because she already smoked me like 20 minutes ago. No, no, no. It's not about. It's not a competition. It's about the food challenge and yeah. doing the best you can. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I see. Thank you for the gifts, then. So you mentioned working out. Do you do a lot of? Um, I do a lot of cardio. Cardio? Yeah. No weight training. I I hold weights while I walk. Oh shoot. Yeah. Dang, built different. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's Lydia. L L L Dan is on the struggle. I am, I am on the struggle train. <laughs> <Dang>. <laughs> Yes, I've actually done stuff in Wisconsin. Um, I did a, I remember doing like a pancake challenge there, a breakfast one, and there was like an egg roll challenge and a pizza challenge. I, I've done some stuff in Wisconsin. I went to Green Bay. I've also been to Milwaukee. Um, yeah, and I also was there during November when it was snowing and it was not pleasant for a Californian girl, I'll tell you that. Oh man, they're not gonna do any more food YouTube videos after this. Oh man. I'm gonna just do travel vlogs from now on. <laughs> just walking vlogs, live stream. <laughs> Can you send me a link to this live? Oh, it's just my uh, at Reina is crazy. On TikTok? Yeah. No, because like, it doesn't save. So it just like, you just have to go to the page. Like, oh, there's no. no link, you know what I mean? I wanna do a shout out. Oh, oh thank you. For people to come. Uh, oh my gosh. All right, I have a solid 20 minutes. Yeah, you got time. Hey, this one, I haven't used it. If you want to use it. Let's see. Nala, why breather. are you? Take a little breather. Um, well, if when you complete the challenge, you get the meal for free, you get Hall of Fame, and you also get a cool t-shirt right here. You and Cheetos. TikTok. So if I copy this link and share on my story, uh -huh. it'll be okay. Yeah. Thank you. Hello. It's okay. I'll be editing this and posting it on like Instagram and stuff too. Try the challenge. The. Okay, okay, we did it. Hi, I love Dallas. Where in Santa Ana? That's a good question. It's some sort of festival. But yeah, th they we're gonna be having a pupusa eating contest on Sunday. Hey, Kendi? You mind taking a photo for us real quick? Stop. He's uh, doing good, he's got Okay, okay. 20 minutes still. Can you do a crazy face? Oh. I'm done. 
Okay. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah nice. Bait. Clickbait. That was good. What? That's a good picture. Yeah. Are you done, Dan? Oh, no, I'm going to keep going. Forty-five Click minutes. Here for life. What minute am I on right now? Twenty-one. Yeah, twenty-one minutes. You still got twenty-five minutes. What's my favorite food challenge so far? I don't have a favorite food challenge. I don't mm. know. You know what? I can actually think of one. There's one in Taiwan that's like a super healthy rice bowl with like purple rice and it's like sweet. And um, it's, it was very healthy. I really enjoyed that one. All right. What are YouTube's favorite type of food? Like Chinese? Uh, uh, hot pot. Uh, hot pot and dumplings. Chinese? Yeah. <laughs> Chinese food. I love eating Chinese food. <laughs> if I want to be broad, Asian and Mexican. But then within M Asian food, Taiwanese. I have to say Vietnamese food because I'm Vietnamese, so. <laughs> Best say that. But probably Vietnamese, Taiwanese, Japanese. Oh, he likes Taiwanese. I'm telling you, you like Taiwanese. You don't like Taiwanese food? No, I never no, 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 no. It's just like I, I just rave just about Taiwanese food like Perma. Yeah. You've been to Din Tai Fung? I don't like Din Tai Fung. No. Yeah. Din Tai is like really uh, industrial, commercialized. How about. It's not Taiwan, me, Singapore, but uh, Paradise Dynasty. It's also in the South Coast Plaza. I don't remember. Oh. I don't think I've been there. Oh man. I'm gonna go to the wheels fall off. Food challenge of wonton soup. That sounds delicious. I would totally do that. My worst food challenge is like just really heavy stuff. Like I hate pancakes and um, you know, I know I've been doing a lot of pizza, but because it's cause like you guys love watching me eat pizza, but I, I actually don't like eating pizza. But I know pizza challenges do really well. We, well, we're, why are you, why? <laughs> Leave him alone. Why? <laughs> Leave him alone. <laughs> Exactly. Thank you. You're doing great. Keep going. Thank you, Brooke. Very kind. Come to New Mexico again. Ah, what's to do in New Mexico? Have you done a, what is this? Oh, Italian pasta. Yeah, yeah I've done Italian pasta. Night, like, a lot of rules, so like, I'm done. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, I challenge myself, though. The, uh, the next, like, uh, trip within the U.S. that I'm going to do is going to be New Haven and that's going to be in September 17th. So I'm going to be in Connecticut and there's a pizza festival going on and I'll be doing a pizza eating contest there. And you're going to Spain! Yeah. Yeah, that's fun. Any recommendation in Spain? Let me know. For food. You said Dan versus food, right? Dan versus world. Versus world. Oh, yeah. TikTok. Was Dan versus food? Yeah. Uh, okay. TikTok. So yeah, make sure we oh, follow no. him. It's Dan versus World uh -huh. DVW on TikTok. Okay. Dan versus World DVW. Oh, right there. On his t shirt. Dan versus World DVW on TikTok. Everything else, Dan versus World. Oh, hello from Germany. Very cool. Hello. When will I do a conveyor belt sushi? Um, You've done a couple before, no? I've done a couple. Yeah. It's just the thing is, I don't eat raw stuff. So mm. when I do it, I'm just eating California rolls or like variations of California rolls. There's not much to it. <laughs> you know, everybody's there eating all like the different fish and stuff. I can only eat California rolls. <laughs> Do 
you plan on coming to Phoenix? Um, I don't know. I mean, I know I have a few restaurants there that I can do that has food challenges, but it, it kind of has to be like, I have to like plan it. We'll see. Yeah, I mean, I have nothing against California rolls, but I just feel like it's kind of boring. I'm just sitting there eating California rolls for like an hour. <laughs> do a hot dog challenge in Chicago. Is there, is there one in Chicago? This is me Ranchitos in Laverne, California. I see. Oh. 26. 26 minutes. I think I'm done off of burritos for the rest of the year. <laughs> You've had a Chipotle burrito, right? Mm -hmm. How many Chipotle burritos do you think this is equivalent to? Chipotle burritos are pretty big. I also I ate like three Chipotle burritos here. So is it like equivalent to like six Chipotle burritos? Like four or five. Five, okay. Okay, well there it is, five Chipotle burritos. Like four or five, yeah. Yeah. So I feel like one Chipotle burrito is like around a pound, right? Pound is pretty heavy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and this was six pounds. So yeah, they got five, six per Chipotle burritos. He, yeah, of course. This is how much he has left. Oh, man. He's going. So he, he's just pretty much got all the tortilla, but the tortilla is the hard part. Mm. What's the ratio of like non-competitive eaters to competitive eaters you collab with usually? Oh. Um, I mean, I collab with everybody. Mm. Um, it's just that for me, that food challenge videos does the best. Mm -hmm. But like, um, I mean, like, it, and like, cause a lot of like non-competitive eating people aren't really down to do food challenges because that's not their forte. You know, they don't want to, they don't want to like sit there and just like kind of like suffer from, cause they're not used to this amount of food. Um, I just collab with a girl named her name is Nanny Eats. She does mukbangs and stuff, and we went to the uh, Little Saigon Night Market. We did like mm. a vlog there. Oh. That was fun. Yeah, so I do stuff like that as well. It's just that, you know, I'm known for food challenges. So stuff like that doesn't get as much views. Yeah, but people like it. People like, you know, the vlog style and me just enjoying different types of food. And um, I'm not Vietnamese, so I, I was just calling everything by, like, English names mm -hmm. of my variation of what the dish is. But I tried my best. Have you tried African food? Yes, I love African food. Very flavorful. Matt Stoney doesn't collab, but I would totally love to. He did come out to one of my food challenges before, though. I've, I have met him. He's very nice. Hurry and finish for the t-shirt, they said. Mm. So that's one really cool thing about food challenges is usually you always get like a t-shirt for ch uh, finishing. So I have a massive collection of t-shirts that I usually just donate. Yeah, but like usually, usually the best like middle point for like how what I do with like uh, vloggers or mukbangers is doing buffets, mm -hmm. you know, because it's like a mix of like what they can do that does well and like a mix of like seeing how much I can eat, but it's not a food challenge. So we're both kind of like doing our good content for us, you know, because mm. like this is specifically more for mine, but like for like mukbangers or vloggers or like food people, they don't, they usually don't like doing this or like spicy challenges. Next one will be on my channel. Okay. We'll okay. do um, we'll do something good. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you freaking out? Huh? Nala's on the side, you guys. Nala, Nala's like, I want a burrito. Nala, can you help me? <laughs> we'll keep this between me and you. We'll share the shirt. <laughs> Dude, I bet, um, I bet Nala could beat me in a food challenge. I think she could eat this faster than me. That'd be a good YouTube content idea. But I don't want to eat, I mean, I have to, make, I have to make a dog-friendly burrito, collab right? Like with, uh, with Nala. Nala collab? Yeah, yeah, Nala, you want a burrito? Yes, you want a burrito? Oh my gosh, she's so happy. She wants a burrito, look. 
She wants a burrito. <laughs> Do no, you guys. She scarfs stuff down. Okay, she. I. I don't know if I can beat Nala, but that would be fun. Oh man, I think I'm just about ready to throw in the towel. This was fun though. <laughs> what are they like sixty percent? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The tortilla is the hardest part. Oh man. There could be a dog friendly burrito though. Like it's just like plain rice and like tortilla, and like. Just plain meat, not too much seasoning. I can do that. You want to do a burrito challenge with Mama? Yeah. Yes. Okay, let me give you. Good girl, not what? <laughs> That'd be cute. <laughs> oh man, so much support from the live stream. I guess I have to go a little bit longer. <laughs> You guys gave me that moral support. Thanks, guys. Has mm. someone ever, you know, you know what, on like one of your videos? Throw up? Oh yeah, yeah. No, I've I've been to uh, competitions where like I'm sitting here, right? And then um, it, was, it was actually a burrito. It was a burrito eating contest. Do you mind me talking about this? No, eating? No, okay, no. all right, I don't want to gross you out. But no, there was a there was a girl like maybe sitting like, maybe like two people afraid of, ahead of me and she was trying really hard. And I think she actually like threw up over all of her there. And I just kept going <laughs> doing my burrito <laughs> challenge. Yeah, I mean like. As long as it doesn't touch you. Yeah, I was like, whatever, you do what you gotta do. But I, <laughs> it was funny. Hey guys. All right. Hello. Beautiful dog. Thank you. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> You're still working on it, huh? You know, yeah, he's still going. 45 go minutes. You Wait, what am I? You're going to do it, right? Thank you. <laughs> Have a great rest of your day, guys. You too. Thank, thank you. you. How much does this cost if you don't finish? That is a good question. I don't know. But the average burrito challenge cost is like $30, $40, something like that. That's the average cost. Well, I just did the new record today. It's five minutes and 25 seconds. You're getting that food coma stare. He's getting the food coma stare. I'm getting uh, delirious. <laughs> yes, That's I know. What happens. It, yeah, I know how you feel. It's, what time is it here? It's like 1 p.m. here. You know what's ironic? What? Look at what we're staring at right now. The clouds? Crunch Fitness. Oh. There's a gym right in front of us. Oh, that's <laughs> funny. Dunzo. Are you done? Okay. I'm done. <laughs> He's done, you guys. He's Threw done. Threw in the towel. Threw in the towel. It's okay. He got five My minutes house. left, but that's what he got left. This is the result, guys. <laughs> All right, you guys. Thank you for tuning in. I will be streaming more League of Legends tonight because I play every day. But yeah, that was awesome. And make sure to check out Dan. Yeah. Okay, guys. So that was super awesome. That was delicious. Dan. Great job, like, great job for not right. doing much free challenges. This was a really good attempt, so yeah, kudos thanks, to you. Thanks for having me. I definitely pushed myself on this one, saw how far I could go. It was a good experience. It was actually really fun being here with uh, Reyna, <laughs> so thanks for having me. Yeah, awesome. So make sure to check his stuff out. I'll put the links in the description down below, but hope you guys enjoyed this video. Check out me, Ranchitos, here in Lovebird. Let them know I sent you. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!